friends. Good morning. So today I'm very eager to share a new case of basal cortical implants. So she is my patient and very has a lot of trust in me, and she has agreed for the basal implants on the region of 36, 37. So she didn't want to actually go for crown cutting. So she preferred a, in, uh, the teeth which is mounted on the implants. So implants are placed in the bone and this particular implants what I am doing they are placed in the cortical bone. They are not the compressed implants or conventional implants. These are basal cortical implants. They are placed in the cortical bone that is below the alveolar bone. So only, the only risk in the mandibular area or in the lower left area is that there is mandibular nerve there. So we have to bypass the nerve. So to bypass the mandibular now, we have two corticals, lingual cortical and buccal cortical. So we take the implant obliquely and pierce either the buccal cortical or the lingual cortical and then straighten it. So these are bendable implants and around 3.5 millimeters width and the length can be around 40 to 60 millimeter or 80 millimeter, maximum up to 20 minutes, 20 millimeter, depending on the bone availability. So in this case, I have taken 16 and 80 millimeter uh, implants. Uh, they are basal cortical implants, and you can come closer, madam. So this and the, even the compre the the implant kit also is very simple. You can just see there are a few screws here. So just now we have finished the surgery, and cleanup is going on. So we have only few few instrumentations. So no, not complicated. Now you can see here, madam, you can come closer. So the patient wanted implants here in the region of. 35, 36, 37. So what I have done is, I placed two 3.5 implants of 16 and 18 mm and firstly I tried to place them on the lingual cortical, it did not succeed much. So I did it on the buccal cortical and it was it was in this angle when I did it in the buccal because the buccal cortical is here and implant was placed obliquely like this. Later on I was, I from this angle I have straightened it like that. So ultimately you can see these two implants are looking parallel with each other. It's very clear, they are looking parallel. So what I am going to do is, this teeth is already cut by some other doctor earlier and there was a tooth here and these two teeth were cut and crown was fixed. So now because this tooth has gone, so she doesn't want this teeth to be cut. So I have placed two implants here and we'll have around three uh, fixed teeth here. One will be mounted on five, six and seven. So Salupa Kedag Matirma, so you can see. It's very very clear. Focus mode so. Uh, so we achieved very good even parallelism also. Uh, very good. So you can see from this angle also. Salpa amma ikade nodu namkade. Very good. So they are very very stable. You can see that even the patient is shaking when I am trying to. So it's very nicely in cortical bone the anchorage has happened. And hal kach kach kore ma. You can see that there is very good clearance also in the occlusion. Okay. So. I can easily fix the teeth here. You can see there, there is 2 mm clearance here. And, and this tooth also is available for us for the crown. So totally there will be 3 teeth here and we are going to fix. Amma sol bai tegiri? Much good. I probably have taken around 20 minutes only for this placing these 2 implants. Close mat kotar ma. Amma heng anstu ni miga implant maadog no vai ta? No one sila. No one sila. Jaldi mugi tans ta? ಕಾರ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಬೋನ್ ಅಂತ ಜೀವನ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ಕೆಲಸ ಮಾಡ್ತಿತ್ತು ನಿಮಗೆ ಏನು ಯಾವ ಥರ ಹೆದರಿಕಿಲ್ಲ ಸ್ಕ್ರೂ ಲೂಸ್ ಆಗೋದಿಲ್ಲ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿ ಕೆಲಸ ಮಾಡ್ತಿದ್ದೆ ಸೊ ನಮ್ಮ ದೇವರ ಆಶೀರ್ವಾದದಿಂದ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂತ ಬಯಸೋಣ ಅದು ಬೇರೆಯವ್ರಿಗೂ ಒಂದು ಇದೊಂದು ಪ್ರೇರಣೆ ಕೊಡಲಿ ಅಂತ ನಾನು ವೀಡಿಯೋ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದೀನಿ ಸೊ ಎಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ಧನ್ಯವಾದಗಳು ಸೊ ಐ ಐ ಹೋಪ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ಎಂಜಾಯ್ ದ ವೀಡಿಯೋ ಯು ಗಾಟ್ ಸಮ್ ಐಡಿಯಾ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಹೌ ಟು ಡೂ ದ ಕಾರ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಇನ್ಫ್ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಾರ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಬೇಸರ್ ಇನ್ಫ್ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಯು ಸಾ 